Welcome to another training session. In today's session, we will learn how we can connect and read the analog 4 to 20 milliamp signal of this temperature transmitter. We will connect the temperature transmitter with the S7300 PLC and program this PLC with the TIA portal software. If you are interested in the PLC programming video tutorials, please check out our YouTube channel and subscribe to this channel for more upcoming video tutorials. First of all, have a look at the wiring of the temperature transmitter with the S7300 PLC. As we have a two-wire analog transmitter, the wiring is really simple and straightforward. We have connected 24 volt power supply, temperature transmitter terminals, and analog input channel 0 in series closed loop connection. Next, we will open the TIA portal software and create a new project and click on the create button. Next, we will add a new PLC device and select the correct part number of the Siemens S7300 CPU. Once the PLC is added into the project, expand the PLC folder and open the device configuration. Select the analog card of the CPU and click on the properties. Here you can see the analog IOs of this CPU. Select the channel 0 and change the analog input signal as current and set its measuring range as 4 to 20 milliamps. Now the analog channel 0 is configured. Next we will go to the IO tags tab. Here you can see the addresses of the analog input channels. The address for the channel 0 is IW752. The analog values from the transmitter connected at the channel 0 will come in this input word 752. Next we will go to the main block OB1 and here we will op open the conversion instructions and drag and drop the scale function. At in we will enter the PIW752 which is the input word for the channel 0. Next in the high limit we will enter 160.0 as the maximum range of this transmitter is 160.0. In the low limit input we will enter 0.0. .0. In the bipolar input, we can assign a memory bit M0.0. In the return value output, we will enter the memory word 10 to record any errors in this scale function. In the out, we will enter MD10, which is the double data register to save the scale temperature values. Now the programming is completed, we will compile and download the program into the PLC and monitor the ladder logic. As you can see that the scale function is working properly and scaling the analog 4 to 20 milliamp signal coming from the temperature transmitter between 0 to 160 degrees and showing the correct scale value at the MD40 data register. That's the end of the today's session. I hope you like it. Do share, like and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for more upcoming video tutorials. Till next time, take care and goodbye.